All right guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Thomas Passy, and like I promised last week, today we're gonna be going on another huge tour, and this one's gonna be full of aquatic animals. I've been going to this aquarium since I was little. I've loved it every time I went. They have insane sharks, they have an octopus, they have seahorses, they have so many animals. You guys are gonna love this video. Watch to the end because there's so many different types of animals, just like there were in last week's video. If you guys haven't seen that, I went on a tour of like this huge reptile zoo so definitely go check that out so yeah i think that's enough talking for now let's get into this tour check it out i'm in the gift shop right here and they got the ripley's believe it or not book and i'm in the book <laughs> so if you guys haven't picked this book up already go pick it up whoa we just got into this room and it's full of huge sharks look at this one the shark is going right over us whoa that's so cool how big do you think it is? It's like eight feet long at least. Look at these fish over here. Yeah, it's definitely taller than me. Look, the shark is going right over me. <laughs> That's so cool. Check out that starfish right there. It's orange. It's so big. Oh my gosh. What kind of shark is this? Is this a nurse shark? Wait, I need that back. Look at the sea turtle. <laughs> it's going up. It's so cool. And look at this huge fish over here. And a shark right behind it. It's hard. It's hard. That's amazing. Look, it's eating. Oh, that's so cool. There are so many fish. Like, there's no way you could even count how many there are in here. It's hundreds and hundreds of fish. And the tank is just crazy. There's so many. The water's so clean too. Look at this one. This one... This one looks pretty grumpy right here. I don't know what's wrong with him. Look at all these. These are like babies. Yeah, these are baby fish. Are they babies? I don't know. Whoa, check out that shark. I don't think they eat them. Or maybe. This one's coming up right in front of me. Check out his teeth. You can see his teeth right there. He's opening his mouth just for me. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh my gosh. Look at that tail. Wow. That's awesome. There's two sharks right there swimming together. And right here you have a sawfish. And sawfish can grow up to 18 feet. And that is insane. That's huge. Look, you can kind of see its eyes right there. That's so cool. There's an eel right here. It's, oh look, it's breathing. No, I don't. These don't electric you. Oh my gosh! Look, there's eels everywhere, and they're huge too. I don't know. That's amazing. Those colors are amazing. There's one, two, three, four right over there. Oh my gosh, look how cool these are. There's like a white one over there. And then there's one over here. It's a different color. And there's a yellow one right over here. That's amazing. The sawfish. You can see his teeth right there on the saw. And now it's going away. But the shark is right here. Whoa. The sawfish is back. I'm gonna zoom in, I wanna see his eyes. I wanna see everything. Its eyes are right there. And then the saw is right there. Right here it says sawfish. Once plentiful sawfish are now so rare they're seldom seen. And they grow up to 18 feet. That's so cool. 
Oh, they're endangered. I didn't know that. Look at all these stingrays flying around everywhere like birds. There's so many of them. And there's little hammerhead sharks swimming around. And there's a huge stingray all the way down there. And there's an, wait, that one's pretty big too, but that one down there is just huge. You can't really see it too much, but there it is. These are stingrays, no? This is an awesome underside shot of the stingrays. I think you can touch them later. Monterey Wharf. A beautiful red fish. They got a couple in here too. They've got some amazing colors. That red is crazy. Like a reddish orange. And then what are these? Look at these. These are, what is that? And look, there's like a catfish over here. Is it a catfish? These almost look fake. Look at their eyes. That's crazy. And they've got like anemones. All of these seem to be live. And there's like little snails everywhere. Look at that one up there. There's something on Spongebob that actually looks like that. Right here they have an octopus and it's kind of hard to see it, but there he is. You can kind of see him breathing right there. And I'm gonna back up so you guys can see his whole enclosure. It's so cool looking. And there you can kind of see him again. All these little tentacles. I think it's like a coral reef that they're trying to like imitate. And there's a bunch of beautiful fish. Look at those yellow ones. Those yellow ones are so nice. Look at that one. Right here they got weedy sea dragons. Look at their colors. They're yellow. It might be the light that makes their colors come out so much. But there's so many of them. Look back there. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's a ton. These are pot-bellied seahorses. There's a ton of them over here. Look at them. Whoa. That one looks pregnant. And is it with all seahorses that when they're pregnant, the male is the pregnant one? It's the boy. These guys can actually grow up to 13.5 inches. That's crazy. It's really cool. They've got a red lionfish. I remember seeing these guys on TV. I saw a story about how a guy got stung by one of these when he didn't even know it was venomous. For some reason, the lighting looks a little bit weird here, but besides that, the fish is awesome. And there's a baby one right over here. Right here they have moon jellies, and it says that moon jellies can be found all over the world's oceans, and most are found near coastal and warm waters. And here they are. these awesome fish over here there's so many of them and over here you can see the fish that there are the dustmer tang powder blue tang yellow tang longhorn banner fish 
not longhorn, long fin banner fish, yellow band anglefish, millet seed butterfly fish, and bat fish. And all of that is in here. They got red piranhas right here. Wow. I wonder if you get, can you can you dive in and then come out alive? Let's get a close up of these. Whoa. They got really cool colors. They've got some awesome colors. What is that back there? That's like a giant catfish. And then this is a paku. Check out that face. That's so funny. Oh, that stingray is awesome. That's so beautiful. I wish I, I wish I knew these fish's names. What, what are these? It says there's an arowana in here too, but I don't see the arowana. I don't know. Maybe she's behind. But this is awesome. This is a giant red tail catfish. She's got that tail. Wow. The stingray is back there. I'm still looking for the arowana but I can't find it. Wow. Horseshoe crabs. We have these in New Jersey. And I, I found like shells of them on the beach. That's awesome. I used to love keeping crabs. These are just like little shrimps. They come in green. They're clean. They're clean? Let me stick my hand near one of the shrimps. Just leave your hand. Alright, I'm leaving my hand there. Oh, they get too scared of me. Keep your hand very, very still. Sometimes they will come to your hands and clean them. When you're done, you want to slowly take your hand back out of the water, please. Porcupine fish up here. There's a big one over there. Nick, Nick, hey, Emily. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Emily, look at the camera. Hey. <laughs> There's three of them here together. That's crazy. But look at Dory. Check out this shark over here. Is this a nurse shark? I'm not really sure. Look, you can see it's fang. It's not it's fangs. I feel like I'm filming a tarantula. It's fins. I got some green iguanas over here. Resting up there. They got a nice place to swim and a lot of room to bask. They got some Pac-Man frogs over here. They've got a normal one right there and then they've got an albino one right there. There's another albino Pac-Man frog over here and there's two more over here. And I don't know how cohabitation works with Pac-Man frogs, so I'm not sure if that's correct. Uh, but definitely do your own research before you buy a pet Pac-Man frog. Besides that, these animals are looking amazing. They look very healthy. I just don't know about that cohabitation. Check out these bullfrogs right here. It's going to be kind of hard to see them because the glass is kind of wet. But they've got some really funny faces. And there's like five in here at least. I saw two over there, two over here, and there's one more back there. Here's another shot of the bullfrogs from behind. They've got an awesome cage over here. They've got some awesome poison dart frogs. Check out those colors on that little guy. They're so funny. And there's another one right here. That one's kind of pinkish silver. And then there's a green one right over here. And there's a blue one. This one's amazing. This is turquoise. There's actually like three in there and they're all green. Here's another turquoise one. And there's other ones back there that are black with some awesome colors. I'll zoom in on that little guy right now for you guys to see. Look how big these stingrays are. This one right here is just huge. That's amazing. And they've got so much room to swim. And there's that light gray one over there floating around again.
Alright, so if you made it to the end of the video, I wanted to personally thank you for watching the whole thing. If you leave a comment on my video telling me that you did, I will definitely reply to you because I read all the comments on my videos. And if you haven't watched last week's video, please go ahead and do that. There's so many different animals just like there were in this video. And if you're not subscribed already, also please do because one of my goals for the future is to hit 1 million subscribers. I don't know if it's possible, but if I was able to hit 100,000, I think it's possible that I could hit a million sometime in the future. So yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, like I said before, <laughs> and thanks for watching.